My name is Jason Golding. I'm a senior instructor at the University of New Brunswick. I've been here eight years. I always tell my students right in the, in the beginning of the year, you know, we're going to learn a lot. It's a five credit hour course. It's a busy course, whatever we want to teach them. But, but, you know, I said, we're going to have fun. And I guarantee you're going to have fun doing it. And you're not even going to know you're learning. It really puts a lot of effort into getting through to the students and connecting with them on a really good level. If Jason's in his office and his door is open, you can walk in at any time. I do everything I can to make sure that they're at ease and, and comfortable with approaching me. And I work really hard at being approachable. He doesn't just want to get you through a course, he wants to make sure you understand. When I was interviewed for the position eight years ago, they said, you know, what would you do different than maybe what when I went through the program? And I said, you've got to get into the field. You've got to get the students out to the woods. Um, all of my courses were outside. Whether it's today we're doing a, a field lab and, and doing some inventory in a, in a relatively immature stand or uh, building snow sculptures. I mean, there's a learning opportunity attached to it, but get them out, get them involved, and, and they don't even know they're learning. They bring a different perspective. I'm not a researcher. I, I spent most of my career in the woods working uh, for a forest company. And coming back, I'm, I feel I'm a practitioner. I mean, I take students out. Not only do I teach them the theory in the classroom, I bring them out here and I show them. They're, they're applying the skills that, that we talk about in the classroom. And, and not only do they, you know, they see maybe how these tools work, they're out in the field and they're practicing and they're seeing how they work and, and hands-on learning. And, and I mean, there's no, there's no substitute for that kind of learning. I mean, we could have talked about that in a classroom, in a lab, for three hours this afternoon. But when they're out here and they're practicing it, there's just no way they're not going to understand it. He gives me exactly what I'm looking for, and that is uh, a sense of some kind of operational experience, which is what he brings to the table. Um, and he's here to get work done, and he's here to make sure that we get our work done. And that's, that's what I'm looking for. Forestry is important. I mean, it's look around you, right? It's the environment. It's not just the tree. It's not just the soil. It's, it's much more. It's the, the, the entire ecosystem. It's the animals that live in the forest. It's, the insects, the bugs, the bacteria, everything that depends on the forest. It, it is my life. I mean, that's all I, that's how I can say it. Forestry is my life.